Houston police investigators are still looking into what caused the fatal wreck that killed a judge, Frank Aguilar. The criminal court judge died in that crash yesterday. Fox 26's Domily Keith joining us live outside the Harris County Criminal Courthouse. Domily. Yeah, it was a single vehicle wreck that killed the judge. It happened after the Texans game around 430 yesterday along 288 along the feeder road near Holly Hall Road. Now the 288th District Court Judge Frank Aguilar smashed his Jeep Rubicon into a utility pole. The 66 year old and his 57 year old female passenger were both rushed to the hospital where the judge later died. Now this judge, Judge Aguilar, has practiced law here in Harris County for decades. Today, the legal community is remembering Judge Frank Aguilar. Well, he was a great guy. I had known him for at least 15 years. I was a prosecutor for a long time. He was a defense lawyer. So we worked against each other on cases. I mean, I can't remember one instance where he ever even raised his voice. Uh, just very mild mannered, uh, a real gentle personality. I've been in front of Judge Aguilar for five years uh, since he took the bench. I regularly practice in his court. Uh, lots of interaction with him personally and professionally. I have nothing but respect for him. He was a compassionate, understanding judge. He was one of the best judges in this building. Describe how shocking it is to hear about his passing. I mean, it was it, it, it was just that. It was shocking. It d literally dozens of emails from people saying how tragic a loss it is, not just to lose him as a judge, but as a person. Just a lot of a lot of grief and a lot of shock. What is the the mood in, in the law community today at his passing? I mean, it's pretty somber. Uh, there's there's everybody. You know, he 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 touched everybody's lives, and so this is affecting a lot of people. It's a real loss to our community. Yeah. HPD investigators haven't yet released what caused that wreck that killed the criminal court judge. Reporting live in downtown Houston, I'm Domalee Keith, Fox 26 News.